What is going on ESGN Net Nation and welcome to another episode here on the channel as we get back into MLB 19 the show. This is Road to the Show with Rashad Bolden. This is episode 203 and we are in the Bay Area. Yes, the place where I left my heart at. I know, cheesy. But today we are going to be in a three game week uh, weeks uh, midweek series here with them. As they are currently 11, or excuse me, 13 and 15. We're currently 11 and 18. And this is a kind of one of those games that we really need to turn this uh, season around here. We're in the second month of the season, and already we're in bad shape as we are, uh, what, seven and a half games behind the leader, who are the Diamondbacks. And it looks like it's not going to get any easier here, as we do have quite a few divisional games coming up here throughout the rest of the season, really. But we also have a lot of games here against winning ball clubs. And if we don't turn things around here and start focusing on winning and especially getting good wins and, and just winning series, we need to most importantly win some series here, especially our, against our own divisional rivals, things are going to be ugly and things are going to be really tough for us uh, on a really long road uh, of just trying to finish the season out. So here you are. We've got some... Uh, chance here to get some uh, play contact or play discipline and some contact here and David Bailey for the Giants will be on the hill today for them as uh, he is going to try to do his best here how he can stop the Padres but most importantly our guy Bolden so let's go ahead and get into action here as we see leaves the Padres right now with 22 RBIs for the season four home runs which he is very lacking in right now it's not like him um, and, uh, well, I guess in some ways, uh, it usually takes about a month or about a month and a half to get really going here. Uh, we re really thought this year was going to be something different, but it seemed like it's just like last year. If it's anything like last year, we already know the outcome of our season. As Bolden here, uh, with, uh, two runners on board here, he tries to outrun this one at first, and he is going to be retired there. So really all hands are, we need to be on deck here today if we want a shot even at, Really, I mean, anything, a wall card, division, uh, and, and most importantly, the World Series, as we'll see, this one's going to drop out there to right field, but the right fielder is right on that one as he is unable to do anything with that at bat. So here we are now, back up to bat here. You see his numbers here as we're in the eighth inning, down or actually up by three, and we're trying our best here to uh, try and get Bolden here, so go, get him going and moving in this uh, opening uh, game of this series and that's another fly ball out to right field as that's out number two for the Padres first baseman as that is going to be it for this one we get enough here to get the win win this one four to two here at uh, I want to say I want to I want to call it PNC Park but I know it's Oracle Park now as they renamed it so uh, yeah we get the victory we get the win and we're now trying to see if we can do the same thing here with the next two games in this three game set. So there you see the numbers one for four for the day. Some other notables there, Para two for four. He had a nice day with a run, uh, run or two and a couple RBIs. So now we go back out to Oracle Park again here in the Bay Area. And you see 12 and 18, 13 and 16 for the Giants who uh, been uh, traditionally the Giants use, usually just do pretty well the opening uh, month or so in the season, but they've had some issues here. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think they even have some injury uh, injuries going on in their team. Uh, so that might be the one of the main reasons why they're not doing so well right now. So as we take a look here, we'll get into the first inning and see what Bolden can do there. You see his numbers in the last six games, and yeah, not too good as he's around that Mendoza number. There around 200, and he is five of 25 in the last six games. So, move on now. As, as he has a one-two count, runners on first and second, and he's going to drill this one out to left, uh, right center field. There, excuse me. That one go. Oh, he's missed by the right fielder. That one's going to go around that triple area, and he is. Oh, he's thinking about going for a triple, but instead he's going to have to go back to second, as the runner at third is going to be halted. And told to stop. So the second inning, he has a dynamic challenge here as he's going to have some bit of focus here. And I believe he is going to try to go with that first one there. Only swing at pitches inside the zone. 
And so uh, we're trying to go with that. He gets a, a plus 50% bonus in his attributes here. 2-0 count, 2 out, nobody on. And, of course, getting trying to keep a rally and keep some, this, uh, something going here with just two outs. This one's going to go high and deep out to uh, right center field. That one's going to drop down for a base hit. And he gets on board there. So the challenge is completed. And there you see as in doubles leaders right now, he has, has 16. So he is definitely running away with that this season here. But uh, those uh, doubles are not really turning into runs here for him. Uh, or for this ball club. So they're getting a scoring position. They're getting guys on board here. But at some point here, they just, they, uh, just bad, uh, just, you know, bad, uh, not necessarily bad base running, but just bad hitting. As uh, we'll see, Ionetta there grounds out there to uh, second. And that's a four to three put away. And that will end the inning. So Bolden left strand there in the inning. But they lead this one four to nothing. Let's move on now to the fifth inning, and we'll see what he can do here. Two for two for today, as he has two doubles and an RBI and a run already in this one. And with an 0-1 count, got a new pitcher out there here in the fifth inning. And we'll see the pitch here. This one's going to be drilled over to right field for a single, putting him on board with nobody out. So good job there from the slugger, as he now is going to be here at first base and maybe think about taking off here no he does not and uh, that one's gonna be caught there at left field so no advancement there from the base runner uh, but there is now one out here in the inning so I wouldn't be surprised if Bolden maybe takes off here in this next at bat as we see Steve Campbell up to bat one for two day to double an RBI and run scored here from him We'll see how Bolden uh, sets up himself in this one. If he's going to take off or not. He's got a little bit of a lead off. And we'll see a 1-1 count. And he is going to take off like I mentioned there. He's going to still second. And he's going to be there on time. Nice jump there from him. As we take a look at show track. And see here what he does in this one there. Nice job there. Good speed. And a good lead there to get himself the uh, stolen base. Now 3-1 with the same uh, batter up here. And we'll see Bolden here. He's going to take off again. Go for third. And he is going to be taken out. Taken out there. And that's not what you want to do there as a uh, guy, as a base runner, getting the last out there at third base. But that's exactly what he does. And he is taken out there. He thought he could get the jump better, but apparently he did not. So here we are now. Three for three. For the day as it's still a four nothing ball game here in the top of the seventh and we'll see what he can do with this one one count that's going to be a four to three put away and that's how they're going to record it in the scorebook as the giants get out of the inning there from a tough batter so as we go now to the seventh inning stretch it's four nothing here at oracle park and we'll see if the padres and they will they'll hold on to this lead and they'll win the second straight game here against the Giants. Win this one four to nothing. Nice job there. As Bolden goes three for four in today's game. Two doubles, an RBI, and a run scored. And that is going to help out his club here. As they are ready to go here to maybe break out the brooms here at Oracle and sweep out the Giants in this ball club or this ballpark here. So there you see the numbers there. Steve Campbell, one for four, double, RBI, and a run there from him. And, of course, take a look at some of the numbers there for the Giants as uh, they just could not uh, muster up anything here today. So the third and final game in this episode here as we try to wrap this one up here and try to get into uh, in the state of mind of trying to sweep these Giants out here and maybe even to the point here maybe we can uh, kind of have them sit down in the cellar for a little bit and kind of help us out but well it's gonna be a tough task we got dusty diaz there six starts three and two for the season his era just under two well under two and uh we'll see if he can try uh to do some uh, damage here to bolden as he had a good uh, go there in that second game Top of the first here, 1-1 one, one count for Bolden, one on, one out, and he's going to swing this one here to high, deep, right field. This is going to go back, and it's going to be caught. Nice job 
as they get the uh, out here. And that is going to be it for Bolden as we go on now to the fourth inning. So now a dynamic challenge here, a leadoff here. And his job is trying to get on base by any means here. And if he does so there, he will get 50 uh, plus 50 in his bonus. But he's going to go ahead and swing for contact here. He wants 75% uh, bonus for himself. And there you see this one gets lofted out there to center field. Uh, to mid shallow center field there. And that's not going to get him on board. So we'll see there. You see the manager there wanting to see what his uh, hitter can do here in this situation. 0-1 count. Top of the six here. Two out. Nobody on. Giants lead this one by two. And this one's going to be dropped out there to uh, center field for a nice base hit. And that's going to get him on board. So now a runner on board here with two out. And we may see Bolden maybe take off here. Try to get in scoring position here. But, oh, that's going to be a swing and a miss by Dickerson. Don't see that too often from him. And that is going to be it for the inning. As we take a look here and see, it's 2-0 here as we go to the last frame of this one. As uh, there you see Bolden's numbers there for the day. One for three with a single back in the six. So here we are, Bolden here. Nobody out, nobody on. Try and get this inning off in the right way. And that is exactly what they need right now to get this inning going and try to get back into this ball game here. Try to turn things around as he gets a single there in right field. Move on. 1-1 one, one count now for Dickerson. And Dickerson here hits this one there to the short or to the second baseman. Gives that one to the shortstop for the double play. And that is going to retire two there. And the Giants avoid the sweep here in their own house. As they win this one, three to nothing is your final score in today's game. So we take two out of three of this series, which is nice. Uh, we actually, uh, you know, win a series here. Not one of the first uh, series we won this season. I think I would say probably. Well, no, I think we won a series on the road before already. But for the most part, it's nice to see we win a series against uh, one of our division rivals, and uh, most importantly, uh, Bolden looking pretty, sh uh, pretty decent here in this series. Uh, he was what three, four, five, six, six for as uh, what six for twelve. So um, a 500 average there for him in this one. Uh, I'm sure they wish he did a lot more in this opening series, but hey, got to take what you can get, and can't really do too much complaining right now because we got too many other things going on besides uh, him not hitting very well. Uh, most importantly, our pitching. I know I've been saying that quite often here in this uh, these episodes here lately. But that is the the issue with us. So as we uh, go ahead and wrap up today's episode, uh, we see we have a series here against the Dodgers. And that will be a series I believe we'll go ahead and skip as we've already played the Dodgers at home already this season. We'll do, do that more often here in this uh, road show here, really all the road shows here on the channel as we're trying to move along here this season. So we'll see coming up in the next episode in 204. We'll have a home. We'll continue that home stand there. We'll, we'll be actually hosting Washington, the Nationals, in that uh, episode. That might be the last time we'll see Bolden here in 19 as we'll go ahead and move him over to 20. I haven't really made a decision yet, but uh, if anything, I think that's what we'll probably end up doing. That'll be a good point where we can uh, switch up things. But yeah, we'll try to see what we can do against Washington. That three-game set there should be a good one there. Hopefully, we have a better job of uh, doing things uh, our way in that uh, Dodgers series coming up. And I'll let you guys know. I'll let you, uh, well, get the stats and stuff like that, what he did in that game there um, coming up in the next episode. So stay tuned as we get ready for 204 here on Road to the show with Rashad Bolden. As always, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like. Let's try to get 50 likes on these on this video or on, uh, any videos of this series. Not to mention, follow us on uh, Facebook, Twitter, and Discord. The links are down below in the description. We do have a Patreon page if you want to be a Patreon member. Uh, if you guys uh, want to uh, help us out here on getting videos out on a more regular basis and do some fun giveaways and all that kind of stuff. Uh, to improve the channel and just I just want to overall just improve the interaction with you guys here on the channel uh, You guys can be that way. There's some cool perks on there that you guys can get and, uh, and So on and so forth. So thank you guys again for watching 
And as always, keep yourselves each other healthy, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you.